Hi everyone, welcome back. You are watching the Data Labs. My name is Dilip. In this video, we are going to discuss an executive sales dashboard that has been developed in Excel. So let's uh, move to this Excel file here. And in this Excel file, if you look at this, uh, this is the sales performance dashboard that has been designed by our team, that is Data, Data Labs. And in this sales dashboard, if you look at this, we have two worksheet data that is, you know, showing uh, for user purpose, basically. So first one is the dashboard and the second one is the sales data. So let's move to the sales data and understand uh, the raw data structure, how we have taken it. So uh, while preparing the raw data, we have considered only those columns which are generally available in any sales performance uh, extract. Okay, so it means uh, if you want to uh, utilize this sales performance dashboard without making any changes, it's very easy because all these columns which we have taken here that are generally available as I said. So you just need to delete all this raw data, put it to your data and refresh the dashboard. That's it. It means you do not need to spend even a single minute in designing your dashboard. Okay. So uh, let's uh, discuss the raw data first here. In this raw data, if you look at this, we have order ID, uh, year, month, sales date, that is the date basically, and then country, sales manager name, then product name, total transactions, quantity sold, sales amount, and total profit. So all these columns here, and basis on these records, we are summarizing the performance data and creating the summary in uh, an uh, internal uh, that is hidden worksheet basically. So let me uh, unhide that. And this is the internal use only. Okay, that's why it's a hidden. So in this worksheet, we are preparing uh, several pivot tables and summarizing all the data. But before uh, creating this pivot or before summarizing, we have calculated this total number of transactions. So all these are measures quantity sold, uh, sold, sales amount, total profit, average order quantity, average basket value, average sales value, profit percentage, sales amount, and profits. So these are the key uh, metrics which we will be utilizing to slice and dice the data on basis on several dimensions like, you know, date, uh, sales manager, country, etc. Okay. So, and then if you look at this, like this pivot is for, you know, by date wise, sold or uh, quantity sold and sales amount in million then by sales manager then by product name and then by country so we have created all these you know uh required uh summary that's a tabular summary so that we can prepare pivot chart basis on that okay so that's all about the internal you do not need to do anything in case if you do not want to modify any of the uh any of the calculation so if you want to modify any of the calculation you can simply go to the pivot table analyze here okay and let me show you and go to the in calculation just click on this fields items and sets and calculated fields so if you look at this all these calculation we have already done so in case if you want to modify this total profit like dollar it's a total profit divided by uh, this we are converting into million basically right so that's how so that's how we can if you want to make any changes or if you want to add any of the any of the metrics, you can do it. Okay, so let me show you the list of formulas. If you are want to look at this, the list of formula in a separate worksheet, so you can you can uh, look at this like this way. So maybe uh, put it formulas, and you can keep it as it is so that anyone can prefer this. So let's hide this internal worksheet. And let's move to the uh, dashboard so in dashboard uh, on top we are we have kept the label so that we can show the executive sales dashboard that's a beautiful way you can look at this font and the branding logo if you want to keep your branding on top left corner you can keep it over here okay below that uh, we have uh, several tiles like uh, we have five tiles over there and all these five tiles are showing all the key metrics which are for sales like total number of transactions okay quantity sold uh, total sales in million total profit in million and what is the profit percentage so this is how uh, we are beautifully showing including like if you look at this we have icon here respective icons and some different uh, color card okay which are very professional below that if you look at this uh, this is the sales quantity and amount trend so by date we are showing the quantity sold and uh, sales amount right 
if you hover over your mouse you can see this the values as well as the date okay and if you want to look at this what is the total quantity sold that is double eight two nine the way i am showing you okay so this will provide uh, provide you the insights of trend basically how it's trending your quantity sold and sales amount so that we can you can take decision accordingly on right side of this chart you can we are showing sales manager like the sales performance by sales manager so sell quantity sold and sales amount so if you, you can see like different manager sales manager is performing in a different way and the how the sales amount they have they are generating basically right below that uh, we are like again the sales amount by product so we have a different products product a product b c what is the contribution of that product like 14 percent product c 10 percent and that's why and what is the total value like in million like 15 million for product e and the total contribution is 27 so that's how we are showing so that you can get the insights how your product is uh, performing in terms of sales and contribution in overall sales amount again on right side the bottom we have sales and profit percentage by country so we have a different country name here australia canada new zealand uk usa okay and how uh, the profit percentage is going on like 27 percent profit is coming from like uh, you know uh, australia 27 again canada so out of total sales amount 27 percent is our total profit okay and then we have sales in million so these are uh, some uh, uh, required and useful graphs and charts which we are showing over here and to slice and dice the data so that uh, you user can slice and dice the data in a different way like we have year slicer month slicer okay then country here and then sales manager and then product name so say suppose if you want to look at the performance how product a is trending so you just need to click on the product name once you select this product a all the value all the cards charts everything will start showing the data for product a only because we have selected product a in our filter section so in this total transaction quantity sold sales amount total profit profit percentage in this all these four uh, charts the performance the values everything will be for product a in case if you want to break uh, show like product a and the james brown how james brown is performing on product a so if you look at this in case if you want to see the performance of james brown only so you can uh, clear the filter from this the product and now you can see that so only uh, james brown how he is performing right then in case like if you want to look at this the country basically like say suppose i'm just deselecting this and want to see how australia is performing so you can see that maybe if you want to look at this the trend for 2022 only so let's see that how 2022 is performing so this is how you can uh, use this executive sales dashboard to generate some insights and take the business decision okay if you think that you if you are interested in learning this dashboard like say suppose you want to uh, learn step by step just put your comments in comment section and uh, if we'll receive a multiple requests so we will definitely record a step by step tutorial and uh, publish uh, the tutorial on youtube okay if you want to download the uh, this template sales performance dashboard uh, we have provided the link in the description box just go and uh, download uh, this executive sales dashboard from that link thank you so much for watching have a great day bye bye